Hi, this is Emily Islanian with TV Insider, and I am sitting here with the cast and creatives of The Good Place. Oh, yeah. Hey. Thanks for coming. Hey. Um, so first off, congrats on the Emmy nominations. Thank it's you. just you. amazing to see how much this show keeps growing. But you're entering your final season. How does it feel to be going into that last home stretch? Betray, betrayal. <laughs> anger, a lot of anger. anger. Comfort eating. Yeah. Tate's chocolate chip cookies. Wow, Ding. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yep. We are um, very, we, it's been interesting. We've known that this was our final season the whole time we've been shooting the final season. So it's been lovely because we've really been sort of taking advantage of every moment and, and soaking it all in and knowing that this is our last season with these characters and with each other and with this crew that we are in love with. And, you know, bittersweet is the word that keeps getting thrown around, but that's what it is. We're, we're, we know how lucky we are. We are so grateful that we got to do this and, you know, it's been fun and we're not quite done. We have, we're, we're about to shoot the finale next week. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's, that's right. Exciting. Have you, do you know what happens? Have you guys read the scripts for the finale yet? Nope. You're no. hiding it from them? They haven't read it yet. <laughs> um, it's done. We wrote it and, uh, I said this at the panel, but we decided we were going to send it to everyone last night, and then I decided to wait until tonight for two reasons. One is I didn't want it hanging over everyone's head as we enjoy <laughs> Comic Con, and the second reason was that it was a metaphysical certitude that Ted Danson would spoil it for everyone that he talked Aww. to. So, scene one. So the season, the season finale was totally heart wrenching. Yeah. Um, Kristen, how long do we really think that she can hang on and watch a memory wiped Chidi just go Chitty through? That's a question careful. for you, really. I mean, we know. yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> Does she hold on? Uh, <laughs> that's my boss. Watch it. Um, I think. Well, look, if I were. Uh, uh, communicating with you as another audience member, because I am, and I love this show, I would say I want to see Eleanor set an example of what it's like to sacrifice for someone and what it's like to see your partner make a sacrifice like Chidi made, which is I got to be the one to go down. I got to help the team, and that means I got to give you up. And sometimes that's what love really, really is. It's that the communication of sacrifice, you do what sort of, has to be done for the greater good. I mean, it's uniquely utilitarian, and that's sort of things that our show explores, but I think um, Eleanor will probably prove her love for Chidi. Yeah. Sure. Aw. Oh. Very good, cute. Good wow. And Yeah, that was great. <laughs> um, and yeah. William, mm. can you say anything about what we're going to see with Chidi now that he's basically been rebooted? Um... I don't know, Dad. I'm right behind you. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, you picked a good spot. Up there. Uh, <laughs> he has a knife uh, in <laughs> everyone's backs. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, I mean, I mean, well, I mean, short answer, uh, I, I, can, I can give you nothing. Mm -hmm. um, longer answer, I think, is uh, <laughs> I can. You know, I, we're in a really interesting space where, you know, narratively, the the audience knows certain things about us that we don't, and I think that that's a really fun place to be. It's a really interesting place to be. And, you know, as, as far as, um, as Chidi goes, I, I feel like there's like a, a sort of evolution that we've been watching over the last few years. And, um, you know, it's, it's, it's really, I think we're, we're, we're seeing some of the work and the, some of the, the seeds that have been planted, uh, starting to come to fruition a bit more. Okay. And, uh, and so, yeah, I mean, I think we saw it at the end of, of season three and, you know, it's this 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 show is a is a bullet train that only goes forward yeah. or backwards <laughs> or whatever. You know, Jeremy, <laughs> Jeremy. so it's like, uh, yes. yeah, or it sets itself. Exactly. But yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, I, I think that's uh, that's that's sort of the integrity of the storytelling does sort of lend itself to uh, a very specific journey. And okay. we're going to you're going to see it. Mm -hmm. Nice. Wow. And you said, nothing. Nothing. You said nothing. Yeah. You said he, nothing. he nailed it. In his defense, he said short answer, nothing. Long answer, and why did you think it would yeah. be? It was just more okay. words of... of yeah. Yeah. It's okay. Um, now, Ted, yeah. Michael, when we last saw him, was kind of having a little bit of a meltdown, uh, to put it lightly. Where is he when we pick back up? 
in uh, meltdown. Yes. <laughs> because we, we always uh, start mm -hmm. the season and every episode where you just left off. So, yes, I'm in full meltdown. <laughs> How do you think he's going to recover from that, if at all, if ever? This short answer, nothing. Short answer <laughs> nothing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Only Mike. Have the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> what do we? Yeah, I, yeah. I think let, let's turn that over to Mike. Well, seriously, uh, I think that the answer d to any question that involves how any of the characters get through anything they're going through is with each other, right? That's sort of yeah. the point of the show, is that you can't do this stuff alone. It's too hard. Life is too confusing. There's too many problems. Um, Eleanor started as a sort of lone wolf character, and and by the time. Uh, you know where where we are. She's you know you, there, we showed a little clip from the premiere, and she's like in a power suit, and she's like running the squad, which is a a kind of thing that she never in a billion years would have ever thought of herself as doing because she rejected the idea of teamwork and companionship. And so that's what everyone has gone through. Everybody, all of the characters have gone through the same their own version of the same process, which is learning the value of relying on other people when you're in times of crisis. And so that's how Michael gets. Wherever he's going to get to is by saying, I only do this with my friends and with my teammates. That's the... Can I add that the, 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 the subject matter that we opened up at the end of last year, which was uh, the point system is not working, mm -hmm. that life is way too complicated, that that you know, foamy part was probably made in a sweatshop, so the fact that you're holding it, you just lost points, even though you're doing this very nice interview, <laughs> you know, is, it makes it impossible to get into the good place. Yeah. So we pursue that thought of how to deal with that. All right. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That was the short answer. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so to swerve away from plot points, you are about to shoot the finale. Is anyone planning on taking anything, if you have not already, from this set? I'm going to take Ted Danson. So <laughs> uh, he's going to come live with me now. <laughs> and, I'm, and she's going to come because I'm going to take a crap load of suits and look really yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah, we, there's so much to take, you know what I mean? Right. There's, there's so, so many I mean, props. every prop, prop every prop, music. every sign, um, it's going to be hard. Painting, maybe? Yeah, it's going to be hard not to take I a think lot. there's going to be a genuine knife fight over <laughs> over who gets the Doug Forsett painting, because oh. I feel like oh, that, yeah, yeah. a lot of us are staking claim on that, and oh, it's going to get real bloody real fast. Yeah. Just we'll just print out more of them. There's no need for <laughs> violence. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. oh. Any other? Oh, uh, I mean, you know, for me, maybe I don't know. There's a couple of there's a couple of really great T-shirts with yeah, things on yeah. them that, that I'm, I'm like, I want to I want to jack a couple of those. You know, I just took something, you guys, the other day. This is not. I, I'm not going to tell you anything, but it would be a spoiler if I did. But I took a tote bag. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. A yeah, tote bag. Nice. I took. I took one. I took one. Did you? No, but we all we need those. Yeah, yeah. Those tote bags are yeah. But I'm not going to tell you what's on the tote bag, okay? Because okay. that would be a spoiler, so don't ask. Okay. Um, All right. Are you finding this interview fun in which we can't tell you anything? <laughs> it's so much fun. I am having so much fun. Manny, are you going to take anything from set? I'm just going to pretend that I'm still going to work, so I'm just going to show up. And <laughs> That's in perfect Jason Mendoza yeah, fashion. pretty much. Like, I love it. I do I think, I yeah, think I'm going to, yeah. um, I, I, legitimately, I'm, I'm moving offices, and I think I'm going to paint Welcome Everything is Fine on the, in the, yes. Yes. right? Yeah. That would I be a cool that. thing if you yeah. showed up for a meeting with someone and you yeah. saw that, you'd be like, oh, good. Oh, cool. I mean, if you've seen the show, you'd be like, oh, no, I'm in hell. But <laughs> but I, I, I really, it's become very pleasing to look at that when we're on that set. Yeah, so I think I'm going to do that. Yeah. I think we're... Sorry, you. No, uh, that's why I shouldn't be talking. I do think the prop department is astounding. Yeah. You sit yes. there and you open up a folder that's supposed to have information about the person you're talking to. And it's in hieroglyphics. It's <laughs> not in, you know, they we'll went out of their way. Probably. Yeah, it's you'll never see it, but it's amazing. like... Amazing. It's brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. I put in for something about three months ago, which is the, um, there's all the signs in our neighborhood, yeah. and I specifically requested the um, too many flowers signs <laughs> because I want to hang it <laughs> in my flower garden. Yeah. I love that. Thank you guys so much. Thank Thank you. You. The Good Place returns this fall on NBC. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.